Check it out. My morning glory bloomed. I got my first morning glory. Cool. Look how big these guys are. No. You guys, the garden is so cool. All these nasturtium are going all the way up the yard. The Empress of India has so many flowers right now. It's amazing. I was just super excited to see the morning glory. The first morning glory blossom. It took a minute to get them to grow. But here they are. So this is a morning glory. It's a vining plant and it will just continually wrap around this and grow up, up, up. So you can see it here. Uh, here's my marigolds. I started these all from seed. So here, here's a perfect way. So if you get marigolds, here's a perfect way you can collect seeds for next year. So here's the blossom, right here. Then when the blossom starts dying out like this, just, just keep it on there and let it go. And then when it's like this, this should be about ready. Let's see. Yeah, look at it. You pull it out. Now every one of those is a morning glory seed. A mor uh, marigold seed. Okay, a morning glory might mean something. So the seed is actually, I'm going to try to, yeah, there's a seed. Now, I'm going to put this down for a second. And I'll show you what a finished marigold seed looks like. That's what it looks like. So if you pull all those, take the dead flower part off so you have this and it's this brown seed part and then this little white kind of fringy part on it and if you take those and put those in a bag or an envelope a paper envelope is the best if you put them in a ziploc bag make sure you do not zip it shut all the way because there's a little bit of moisture in there and it will start molding in there and you don't want it to mold but you can just put them in an envelope or a little bag that's not zipped all the way shut so it gets a little airflow and then next year you just plant them in the dirt and plant them with that brown side going down it doesn't really make too too much of a difference but that kind of helps it out and then you got a whole bunch of free marigolds. Now, if deer are coming around your garden, um, marigolds are a deer deterrent. Deer do not like the taste of marigolds. So you can, you know, try to plant marigolds all around. All right, so look at all those free flowers now. Check out how many squash I have.
Let's go look at this big guy, see what's going on.